fans, friends, and neighbors, um, this is Angry Hobbit, and it has been a long time. I've been, been having all kinds of adventures and technical issues, and I switched to a totally different computer, which took me a while to get all my stuff figured out. Uh, but I am back. We are not going back to Haunted Halls yet today. So since I'm on a different computer, I am going to need to um, work through the game again um, and, you know, basically play through it to a point we left off at last time. So instead, I'm going to go ahead and start a new game. It is from the series you guys have seen before. This is from Dark Romance. And this is, I think, I need to calm down. fifth installment it's the most in the series. Of my life. It's called A Performance to Die For, and it is based on Phantom of the Opera. Her angelic voice will be the final piece for my opera. I don't like this Phantom. He's like too clean, clean up clean cut. Um, all right. So we are going to go pop in our new player profile. Okay. And let's go again. So just looking, you know, at, at the, some of the settings, you know, some of the paraphernalia, see, I'm just looking to see if anything looks familiar. Now let's go with casual, like I said, because we like to cheat, we like our um, various hints and things to, you know, charge quickly. That was kind of gnarly. Christine Burns, you are the most amazing woman I've ever met. I love you more every day. Will you marry me? Oh, that was such a lame, like, ditzy girl. I hate to interrupt your wedding plans, Doctor, but I have the role of your life for you. Who are you? See, that's its insistence. She should already know who he is. Well, I guess, you know... You know, they've obviously changed names since in the original her name was Kristen Dye, not Kristen Burns. So, so, okay, uh, it looks like our two, you know, players will be Christine and Raul. Um, we have our hint, just kind of looking around here. So right now we cannot interact with anything in the room. We'll just have to go through the mirror or not not so fast could they have made him more melodramatic this is the bit I actually don't like you know they're a little bit too too over the top no nah we can we can str struggle through so her cute little shoes okay so we are gathering the Posters, that's kind of our prize thing. Um, let's see. We just have a little. All right, and of course, yeah, they changed Raul's name to his name in the book and the movie was Raul de Chagny found a crystal so we are looking for crystals and posters and we need a lever okay nice okay we have some tickets and we need to break into that particular little lock Why do we need a fur scarf? I don't know, but we'll find out. Christine's diary. Oh, another puzzle piece. OK, 
Okay. All right. Oh, here's what we are gathering these things for. So we have these puzzle pieces. Uh, we still need more. Okay, no problem. We'll just look around. And yeah, as usual, I strongly recommend, hey, that's a symbol. Um, we'll need, I think, probably spray it with something or write on it. Whoa! Okay. Aha, uh -huh, we have a little pin. I know what that's for. That is to uh, pick that lock. Okay, we need to water the flowers for some reason. That's a priority. Whoa, <laughs> there was a bee in that one. All right, so let's see if we can poke through this. Here we go. All right, that's our task. Oh, okay. All right. Hmm. Yay! That was cool. Oh, kitty. Sorry. If you have been following my channel at all, you all know very well um, if I see an adorable animal, I'm just gonna get instantly distracted because that's just how I function. I love these shoes. Kind of turn of the century. So we're looking for an, it's purring. Oh, kitty. Kitty's cute. Um, and that's not one of the, that's not a perfume bottle. Okay. So looking for, oh, this one, another perfume bottle. Necklace. Ooh, nice necklace. I approve. Wouldn't mind if I had one. The scissors are broken. Oh my God, how many times have we had that particular puzzle where we had to put two halves of scissors together? Here we go. So here's our scissors. We have our comb, our feather, and we have our powder case and oh just like i said that's what we need to make that symbol more pronounced oh i hate these i can never quite do them right i always slip up oh damn and it's like every time you you know, waddle over the borders a little tiny bit. Come on, come on, come on, come on. It gets all the way to the end. Here we go. Or I'm sorry, rather to, to the beginning. So, okay, so we know we need we need to find water at some point. We still need to find the lever. Is that the lever? No, that's a, well, actually see, apparently, no. Okay. Um, so that didn't work. Although I like it that they like, they actually let you try in this. Have you noticed that? I like the games where you try something and it says, hmm, good idea, but not quite that thing. So I think that's kind of cool. Help me, my love. Oh, you've managed to make it through. Congratulations. If you truly value your own life, you won't take another step into this dungeon. This place is well protected from interlopers. Deadly blah, traps blah, blah. are hidden everywhere. Good it's your know. choice. Leave here or die. Okay, so she sent him this sort of amulet theater prop okay so we're looking for like a whole bunch of stuff we have crystals posters and theater props like that one so we're like gathering stuff like crazy oh we have a map I I didn't even think about it um, 
this needs something probably um like a skeleton uh like a skull head it looks like this is broken so we need to find the bits and pieces for it oh hi little mouse okay so we're looking to fix the lantern we need water this little guy has something we need probably and what is that whoa Yee! that would have hurt let's like not do that so what does that do hey who is she she's a ghost my name's agnette isaac kept me in this dungeon for years before killing me to make me a member of his troop that's what he calls the group of ghostly singers he's assembled that's creepy it's unbearable i tried to get his spellbook and move on to the realm of the dead isaac found out and bound me to this pillar that's like mean i know where he took christine release me and i'll help you find them hmm Okay, so we need to find the little fitted pieces that go into the cuffs on her. Oh, there's that. Hi, little froggy. Ugh, that is gross. Here's a crystal. We know we are always looking for crystals. Okay, so again, so we tried something. We tried the, the wing nut. It didn't work because we need the whole entire thing. Uh, we need the the valve so this is broken it needs okay so we have the stud for it we just also need to find the lower jaw great not to mention creepy hmm all right so just out of curiosity let's see how the map function so as before we have you're here and stuff where we have ah good it it has an extra little helper there it tells us if we have extra stuff like crystals and posters and bits and pieces we need to find okay so i think this was yeah here we go this is what our feather boa was for great all sorts of things there so we can fix the skull got the jaw into place here we go perfect that's kind of pretty actually and we can hand it to the angel awesome nice okay so we have a couple of things there we have the valve what does that mean okay so there's probably a code there um not sure how to pull the feather on him uh, let's pop over because we now have, I think that's the lever we've been looking for. Oh, get over here. There we go. Yeah, that, that fits. Look at that. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. So we have a magnet and a mirror. That goes into the lantern. So the other thing we need is the source of light for this. So, so far, and by the way, uh, a lot of games use this when you are working with a piece that needs other stuff like this lantern for example when you have that you know stuff to complete it in your inventory um, it will light up green and sometimes it's just the outline sometimes it will glow and kind of jump around a little bit you know so um, but usually you know when you have a kind of a composite piece um, that's what it means okay so let's go and fix the valve here we go so that goes here and let's put the nut on yay happy frog there we go so that takes us somewhere ah and we have a source of water so we can go back and water our flowers Here we go.
Beautiful. Oh, source of light, glowing flower. Remember he had a letter, you know, we have a letter there where we said, hey, I send you this beautiful glowing flower. There we go. So I hate to do this to the poor little baddie bat there, but I'm going to point light at it and um, he's going to fly away. I actually love bats. I think they're super cute. Uh, we have a lot of them here. Um, oh. Okay. Well, we have magnifying glass. Here we go. So, we have six, four, and two. So, what does that do? Hey! Aha! Just what we needed. We have bat wings for her cups. Perfect. Oh god, I hate these. I, I don't do too badly with these. They do tend to frustrate me. There we go. Especially the super complicated ones. Thank you. Pretty, I like her. I can help you move to the other side of the crack. Excuse me? Just take a second. How about we call it a chasm or uh, an abyss? Calling it a crack is a little bit undignified. All right, here we go. So is there anything else we are missing here? Let me just pull up the map and just make sure we didn't miss anything here. No, it doesn't look like we missed anything here. So we're good. All right, onward and upward. Or downward as it may be in, in this particular case. Oh no, I'm so sorry. Isaac's dungeon is full of things like this. I don't know where most of them are, but I've learned some of the types. Okay. This cage can only be opened with a magical key. I'll look for Christine and ask her to find it for you. Take this. It's not much, but it might help. Hmm. Okay. Um, I guess I'm just gonna, like, sit here and polish my nails. Okay. So, here's... How do I... How do I swap characters? Because, remember, in the past, we had... Um, a way to, to swap. Hmm. So, how do we... Oh! That's... Okay, the medallion, of course. So, that's how we switch between characters. So, that was basically another game trait that was given to you as an object to figure out. Just make it okay, makes sense. I got it. <laughs> Christine, my darling. Oh, it's so nice of you to finally join us. Oh, my name is Isaac, and I'll be your director. Your unique and heavenly voice will be the crown jewel in my ghostly opera. Mm -hmm. I will go down in history as the best opera director ever. I All just right. need to finish some preparations before I can perform the ritual to add you to the troupe. Uh, you'll have to stay here for the time being. And please, be a good sport and don't try to escape. Otherwise, there will be repercussions. Okay, so the reason I laughed was when she was blinking her eyes is I remembered the um, the haunted holes when we blink our eyes and we wake up, you know, out of unconsciousness to discover we're staring at a kangaroo. I have expected a kangaroo even though it's a totally different game series. Okay, so what do we need to do? That's it? But that was easy. Hi, 
maaf sih. Um, okay, so do we have? First of all, I'm gonna look around and see if we have any objects of interest, so so to speak. We need like a... Um, <laughs> I, I need um, an, an umbrella or something. Something I could use. Whoa, wonderful. Okay. What does that do? Okay. Oh, good. Violin bow. So this needs to be fixed. We need a hook. For this. Uh, this is gonna be a cutting device, I have a feeling. And I'm sure you've seen a lot of that in various games. You know, you find a piece of glass and it magically turns into this like super knife. Okay, so what else have we got here to look at? We've looked at that. Uh, there is a um, Oh, that's cute. So, LaRue is actually the last name of the original, the author of the original book, Phantom of the Opera. So that's cute. Nice, nice little um, tribute to her, to, to the author, not to her, to him. Um, okay. So we have the note. We have these kind of emblem things. Ugh. I didn't mean to twist your head off like that. Sorry. That was kind of mean. Okay, so that's... We're still looking for this. We found a crystal. Can we do anything else? Okay. So, that's Ignat. By the way, if you would like to... Uh, read a fun sort of alternative ending um, Phantom of the Opera story. Um, find um, Phantom of uh, Beauty and uh, I'm sorry, what is it called? Beauty of the Opera and the Phantom Beast. It is a such a gorgeous story. I really really love it. Um, it's absolutely beautifully written. Um, I've read it, I don't know, 50 times at least. Um, and, and I just love it. It's, it's just so wonderful. Okay, so... There we go. So that pops the door open. So we have two, two, two places to go here. Uh, dancer figurine. Do we... Is that like for here? Yeah. No. It isn't? This one? Okay, oh, so, okay, so it doesn't fit to any of these. Well, what about here? Just curious. No. Okay, so neither one of these uh, would work. Uh, well, this is his room, and in the, in the, I think, originals, in all of the originals, uh, the Phantom's name was uh, not Isaac, it was Christine. Eric. Raul is trying to rescue you, but he got trapped in a cage. You must help him escape before Isaac kills him. There must be a magical key to unlock that cage somewhere around here. Let's look for it together, and I'll bring it to Raul. All right. Okie doke. Um, so we met her. We have a bunch of... Can we pull this out? Great. All kinds of stuff here. Okay, so we need something to cut through the wires. Oh, and we, okay, see again, this is the frustrating part. Um, you know, uh, we had a cutting device and we lost it after one use. Um, I mentioned this before, I hate it when that happens. So we need a little skull emblem to read the diary. What is that? We need to start a fire. Oh, who's this little guy? 
Oh, and there's a place for our little ballerina. Here is our skull emblem. There's something that go there. We need to feed this guy. Okay. Okay, so here's this is what the triangle pieces are for. Okay. Um and this is this this looks like it's neat it needs to be fixed. It needs a mask. Um we'll see. It might need a bunch of stuff to to get it working. Whoa, didn't mean to do that. Actually, that would that was dumb. It could start a fire. So that opens up. Once I was a successful musician and ran my own great opera house. My performances and productions always played to a full house. Everyone knew the name Isaac Clodin. Everything was great until the chandelier fell from the ceiling. The whole building began to burn. I was ready to die with my opera, but my stage manager Dirk rescued me. Okay. I can't stand the thought of my opera house's demise. I'll do anything to restore my troop and retrieve my former glory. Uh, the old opera house that sunk underground is the perfect place to rehearse my new ghostly opera. Except it's creepy as hell. Ooh, like the owl. There we go. Aha, so here's the mask for the robot there, the automaton. Okay, what is that? Ah, a hook. We needed a hook to make a fishing rod, basically. Okay. Theater prop. There is a theater, another theater prop in here. Not seeing it. Oh, there it is. Oh, that's a little bit, they're making it almost too easy. It tells you what it looks like. Did you see it was glowing like a little violin and that's what we found? All right, let's see what we got here. Whoa, oh great. We have a fish we can probably feed to the little raccoon fella. Okay, so we still need bits and pieces for this. Um, don't have anything to make a handle out of. Let's go feed this guy. Yep, that's all it took. Okay. So... We don't have the emblem, if memory serves me. Makeup box. What is that for? So, do we have anything I can use to remove that? F nope. Not yet. <clears throat> I do have all three of the missing pieces. So, there. that. Uh, this one needs to turn. There we go. What does that do? Okay, we have another door. Whew. All right. What is that? Something alcohol based, like perfume. And we have a sponge. There we go. Here we go. Okay, so what we need to do is make up the model. 
as shown in the I guess it's it's not really a reflection it's a it's a picture okay is there anything else yep that's it so this gives us another chess piece so one like that's actually my favorite ballet of all times I have uh, three different versions of it loaded up on my computer and I I must have watched it I don't know lots of times just love it all right <laughs> that's not gonna work ah that is an ugly sound I wish I hadn't done it okay so we need to repair the um, the bagpipes I, for what purpose I don't don't know I hope we are not gonna have to make uh, you know make music with the bagpipes so we have a working hacksaw that's good always a good idea well I d why did that fall down um, can we cut it with yep there we go hi little guy okay so we have a little So in case we need to bring Miles some food. Everybody wants something. All right, let's fix that. Whoa, okay. Oh, I totally missed it. Okay, so here, I think, no. Oh, no, that wasn't that one. Was it this one? Yep. Here we go. That. I think this is where we find our little symbol. That symbol? Okay. Um... Okay, so we need to move these pieces. And swap them out. All right. So here's, here's one. This one needs to be elsewhere. Well, let's get the right pieces on the right people first. And then we'll figure this out. So, for this one, there we go. So we have that one in place. Now, the question is, see I hate these. Um, I'm, I'm, I have trouble planning with them. Um, let's see, let's turn this over and bring this over here, okay? So we are missing the hem of her dress. So what we need to do is position her where she's supposed to be with respect to that piece. Here. Okay. Except now we stole his ear again. Damn it. You know what? I'm gonna go ahead and skip because you know, that's what I do. Aha! Uh -huh. There's our magical key. Is there anything else we can do in the meantime? I still don't have his eyes. I still don't have the food for the mouse. That's okay. Okay. Hey, lady. Come down. All right. You found it. Now we just need to remove the ghostly wall. I've seen Isaac walk through it many times, but I don't know how he does it. He must use some powerful magic. 
Maybe Raul well, will find a way to get rid of it. Well, he I'll give him the magical key right away. Hang on. Okay. So we found that um I'm before we switch to Raul. I'm going to pop over um that other hallway and just see what goes on there. Okay, so that's what she was talking about. Halt. Only Master Isaac or someone he entrusts with the ghostly artifact may proceed. Okay, so I need a ghostly artifact, basically, is what is the implication. Alright, so let's pop over back to Raul. Actually, uh, I still need to figure this thing out. All right. Christine found the magical key that Isaac was hiding. Here it is. She'll be fine once we get her out of this. Oh, piece of cake, right? There's a ghostly monster guarding the exit from her cell. Oh, try not to sound so tragic. We'll Isaac figure it out. Or the holder of this ghostly artifact. I saw him take the artifact to his assistant's room not too long ago. Maybe it's still there. It's the huh. only way for Christine to escape. All right. Huh. Hmm. All right, so here's our magical key. Very cool. That works. So where are we? Learn how to remove the ghostly wall. Okay. I'm working on it, dude. Um, so this is pretty creepy. In sort of a grand sort of way. Okay, here is where we pop in the stuff that we found. I think that's right. Yeah, there we go. That's pretty. I kind of like that. Okay, we have that. Oh! Um, we, we're gonna need to find something heavy, I think. Like a hammer or something. See, this piece just rolls back and forth. This guy- Oh, that is so cool! Like, I haven't even done anything. Uh, we need another- Oh, bugger off. Um, so we have all of these cool looking skulls we need to find another one good times we need something to dig with fine can i use the magnet yes i can ha ha, ha. figured it out have some glowing mushrooms not sure if they're relevant uh we need yeah you know what everybody in in these games is so spoiled they can't dig with their hands they they have to have a trowel or a you know, a shovel. It's just lazy bums. You know what? Dig the damn thing. Nothing bad's gonna happen to you. You'll be fine. Uh, here's... That's what that's for. So, we have another... Okay, can we uh, dig with our hand in a glove? Can we do that? No, apparently not. <sighs> Because I'm a pampered aristocrat boy, and like that's just impossible for me. Okay. I lost everything when my opera house was devoured by fire, but I won't give up. I think I found the way to. E Long ago, I wrote the most beautiful opera of all time, but no human voice is able to perform it. Time. So, are we looking for clocks? Yes, it looks like. Yes, we are. Clocks and watches. Only a creature who doesn't need air is capable of performing it. Ah. A ghost. Well, that explains why he started killing people and trapping him, trapping them. I've in studied many books and found the perfect way to yeah, bring my masterpiece layer. to life. Soon the world will see Isaac Clodin's ghostly opera. Okay, so we need to find more books here. Books, books, books. Here we go. And here is our lovely, lovely skull. That is so fabulous that we need 
to put here. There we go. Here we go. Okay, so now we have stage access. Very cool. Let's go and see what we can find. Who's this guy? Isaac, I'm begging you. Release me for a day. Must be At his least. assistant. I've been in this dungeon for so long that I feel like I'm turning into a ghost myself. I haven't seen the light above for ages. I miss it so much. I know what you mean, dear. Oh, please, come with me. Oh. That was creepy. That's like seriously I can creepy. See right through you, Dirk. You should think twice before trying to escape from me. Like, who came up with this and what they were smoking? Okay, we have to been so somehow long save this guy. I've seen another living soul. Please help me. This thing's grip can be weakened with the protective scepter. Find it, and I'll help you escape. Oh, goodness. Okay. Let's look around. So this is a bit of a mess. There's his baton. Uh, okay, so that's why we're fixing the trombone. There's the piece from the trombone. Um, okay, we're looking for the little statuette to play the harp. There we go. We have a, a functioning trombone here. Aha! Uh -huh. Okay. Rusty knife. Okay, we have to sharpen the knife somewhere. And it tells us there is a, a theater prop here somewhere that we need to. Is that it? It looks like a violin. Hmm. Well. Does anybody see a violin? Because I don't. Okay, we can't get up there. I mean, I, th that's the one I see. I'm... But I can't seem to like get to it. There's that. Oh, was that it? It was an instrument. It was a, a spike, um, one of the winds or something. Hi, little guy. Um, glove. There we go. Come on, fella. Oh, aren't you cute? Yes. So, what do I use the owl for? Um,. Okay, this one is snapped, so I need... the tool that is used to adjust the strings. Unless... no, it's not gonna let me use anything else. Okay, so what is here? What do we got? We need to hold that in place, so we need... okay, I see what we need. We need a chain to hook down onto this thing down here so okay let me see what we have got here so i am in the right place i am where i have stuff to do so that's where i need to stay i just need to keep looking around wow Um, that was officially weird. Can I send my little owl up here to knock that Ooh. thing over? Come on, guys. Come on, little guy. There you go. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Music stand. What can I use the music stand for? Can I somehow... No, I don't have anything that is, like, long enough. Oh, got an action over here. Okay. So, can I dig with the music stand? Yes, that's our impromptu shovel. 
Um, that's weird. Okay, then. Okay, so here is our various bits and pieces of that thing he was talking about. That is that is so weird looking. Oh, and here's our hammer to widen. Well, yeah. Why can't I widen the crack with a hammer? Hello? Well, that's... Okay, can I, like, squeeze that through? Nope, I can't. That's strange. And Okay, well, I guess there is some other solution. All right, here we go. Whoa! Um, what does that... Do I need to line them all up? So, these need to all line up with these. Okay. So, I think they need to, like, match up these guys in the center. So, let's see. Well, or maybe not. I don't know. Oh, hang on a second. Let's, let's just see. Oh, okay, so I need to, here's what needs to happen. We need to flip it out, boom, 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 flip it over, pop it into the right place. That's what we need to have happening. Okay, all right, so then we need like this one. Let's see. It's, this one is already there, so here, let's flip down here. Okay, good. Um, this one is in the right place. This one, this is weird. Ah, here it is. So here, no, just move it one over and flip. There we go. Now. This one is in the right place. Where is this guy? There he is. All the way there. Okay. So. That's done. Better? Thank you so much. I'm Dirk. I used to organize all the performances in Isaac's Opera House. I was one of the very few who survived that terrible fire. Okay. Isaac needs me to organize his ghostly opera. His soul has turned black and he's become obsessed with yeah, his idea he's pretty of dark. a trip of ghosts. I can help you and your beloved escape this miserable dungeon. Find the artifact that removes the ghostly wall and I'll bring it to Christine. All I ask is that you take me with you when hmm. you escape. Take this. It may be useful in here. Hmm. Oh! I know exactly what we're going to do with that. That's going to allow us to fix up our um, our le lever over there where we are lacking some extension. There we go. See? That worked. Yep. Here we go. All right. We have some. Okay, so it's not the crystal that we are assembling. So that's the lady who apparently was in love with him. So we need another crystal over here. We have a poster we need to find. There's a kitty under there. All right. Can, can I grab it with that? Yep. Okay, what is that? It's a broken key. Okay. Well, I don't have anything to cut this open with. Let's keep exploring. Fabulous hat. Whoa! Didn't mean to do that. This is where Gandalf would say fool of a took. If you don't understand that reference, we can't be friends. <laughs> okay, let's 
So here's a half of the figurine. And we don't have anything to write. Well, we have quill and ink. Will that work? Oh, that is such a cheat. Okay, that's fine. That's cool. Okay, so we need find, to find bits and pieces of this. We're missing some. And here's this. Here is our... Okay, so what it looks like, we need to press the symbols that make up the hole. So let's try this. Here, here, and this. That's one. All right. This. That. Okay, that works. This one. Here. Um, that. And... That works. Okay, so what is that? What's that in there? See, I want to grab that. Oh, bummer. I thought there was something else in that compartment. That's a disappointment. Okay, so we're still missing like the cross piece for the key. <sighs> like nothing works. Chisel. Oh, oh, I know what the chisel is for. Let's go back. Let's go back. Okay, so we can't widen the crack with the hammer, but we can widen it with the hammer and the chisel together. Fine. And here is our portion of the broken figurine of Christine. So somebody shattered this thing to pieces. Why don't we have a lighter? Oh, we have the two both masks. Great. Okay, so what does that open? Up oh, here's another portion of that. And I bet you that is a cutting implement we've been looking for. It's either that or we're gonna use the rusty knife because here is the sharpening stone yep so we're gonna grab that and sharpen the knife Ugh, i hate that sound ah! <laughs> Oof. that is not you know the sharpening stone is a wonderful invention but oh i hate that sound okay so let's go ahead and cut this because apparently we're unable to you know, figure out how to untie a knot. So let's get this glued together. <laughs> Assemble Christine into one statue. Here we go. I love her dress. I really love that. That is so beautiful. We're gonna have to coax that cat out of there. We know that, right? Okay, so here is And there's our key. Here we go. And boom. Okay, we are ready to open the box. Here we go. And we have a hidden object game. All right, so we need to complete the medallion. Uh, where does that go? doll. Here we go. The doll apparently was not really a doll without uh, the bow on her head. <sighs> if you say so. It's a very filthy mirror. I love all the bling and fabulous shoes. Like Those are gorgeous. I, I, I want all of them. Comb and binoc binoculars. So there's the binoculars. Where's the comb? Hello, comb. Grunt control to major comb. Seriously. Where's the damn thing? Here it is. Oh, here's our fabulous crystal, which we need over here. So what does that do? Oh, okay. So how? Oh, no, 
No. Okay, so we only need to press the ones that are relevant to the puzzle. So not not the ones not all of them at random. Which makes sense. Okay. There's that. Uh where's the one that looks like a cactus? There it is. And then of course the last one. There we go. What is that? That is the ghostly artifact. Okay. Well, that was kind of cool. So we still need to open that box over there. Is there anything else going on here that we know of? Oh, well, and we know there is a cat under the trunk, which we have to still, you know, have a conversation with. Stella job. The path to Christine's cell is very dangerous. Isaac filled his dungeon with we traps that. so that nobody could but find this place and disrupt his plans. Fortunately, I've lived here for a very long time. I know this place like the back of my hand. I'll bring this artifact to your beloved. Be very careful. Not everyone here is as helpful as I am. Isaac's assistant, Bruna, is very dangerous. Okay, so we still have to deal with her. Where is that pathetic insect, Dirk? Well, that's a mean I'm thing I'm supposed to, to see if he's learned say. his lesson yet, but I guess it can wait. I'll deal with you first. She is mean. That just like knocks you out. Wow. Well, that is cool. And we're back to proceed. Christine, hey, Raoul managed to find the ghostly artifact. It will help you remove the protective ball Isaac set up over there. Unfortunately, the artifact is yeah, damaged. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We and have to fix it. I get it. Lost, I get it. But I believe you can find them around here. I'll, I'll see I what have I can to go do. now. I don't want Isaac to notice that I'm absent, or he'll be furious. Good luck, Christine. All right. Bye. You know why I couldn't have just like followed him through that door and out? I don't know, but I guess you know we'll we'll find out. All right. So what do I have? Or don't have. We have these gems missing. So. Leather belt. Is that is that what we're gonna use to? Yeah. Wind around that. Oh, you need to tie it up. Oh, we're gonna tie it with a purple ribbon and make it all pretty. Oh, hello. That's one of the skull's eyes. Carving knife. Uh, because I'm I'm just gonna turn into an expert cover and like totally carve out this chest piece. I'm just like totally good like that. You know, I rock. Okay, so now we have the two chest pieces that we're missing. Um What's the purpose of the game? Block the path of Isaac's dark chest piece to push it back. Um, what am I supposed to do? No. 
Okay. I may skip this. I like this puzzle. It just takes a while. Okay, bird wrench. What does that do? Liar emblem. Where did we have the liar emblem? Does anyone remember? Um. Oh. Hang on a second. Oh, I forgot. We. It's not. This is not where we have the um. Um, the knife. Well, no, it is. Up oh, here we go, and we have a replacement gear, so we can put that back on. That comes out. There is this cheese for the mouse. That is awesome. We have flint and steel. Oh, we lost our knife when we use it again. You know, don't like that, but yeah, let's just deal with it. Flint and steel. Oh, okay, they're they're wet. The logs are wet, so I have to spill something onto them in order to make them flammable. Okay, we have clippers. We still need a little rivet for them. There's needle and thread. We can fix the bagpipes. Oh, <laughs> okay, and now we can fix, that was so weird, that eye popping out of bagpipes, that, that's rad. Okay, and here's our little rivet to fix the clippers. Come on, get over. All right, so this now works. We're done here. We have something to cut. No? This is not what we used to cut the wire? Well, fine then, if you're going to be like that. Uh, where is our mouse? Here's our mouse. Here you go, mouse. Bye. Oh, you're so cute. We have an oil can. We have, like, we're accumulating objects at an alarming rate. So we figured this one out, figured this one out. We're just still figuring out the fire and here's our solution we're gonna spray this with oil and light the fire here we go ah we're gonna make the piece that goes to the grave Ow. well we have a bowl of water you flipping idiot why did you go and like stick your hand into it uh can we cut the wire with the clippers is the question yes we can and we pop this open. We have a jam for one of our eyes over here. Good. We're like rolling right along. So let's fix the grave. Gives us another eye. Not eye, I'm sorry, another jam. And I think that fixes it for us. So now we can just stroll right up to this monster and tell it to let us through. All right. Okay, so there is another puzzle here and we're right at an hour of mark. So I think we're just gonna go ahead and pause here. This is a really good um, place to pause. You know, we defeated the monster, good times. So um, thank you for everybody uh, watching and uh, following. Again, I apologize for having been away for so long. I'm glad to be back. Uh, you can always find earlier episodes and other games lined up in neat little um, playlists on YouTube under Angry Hobbit channel. And... Uh